Hey guys, what's up? This is Sparks, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to download and install Jerry's Mod for 1.4.7. Alright, so first thing, if you guys look down in the description, you're going to find this link. Um, this link will take you straight to the forum page for uh, Jerry's Mod, so you guys can come here. Um, if you guys go straight down to Downloads and download this, um, so latest version right here, download that. Um, also, there will be a link in the description for Forge, so it will take you right to this website. So if you guys download this universal version, at fly or direct, does not matter. So if you guys have downloaded both of those things um, you'll see the Jerry's mod right here and the Minecraft um, uh, Forge so once those are both downloaded and installed onto your desktop um, there you also find a link in the description for Optifine. Optifine is not required for this mod but I do recommend it for um, for Minecraft because it, it does uh, get rid of lag in your Minecraft game alright so um, First thing I want to say though, um, if you guys are looking for more of a Minecraft review of what's actually in the mod, um, you can actually look right on the forum page and you'll see uh, Captain Sparkle's um, video himself right here. Also I do, I will have a link right up here in the um, top left hand corner, you guys can see my mod review of the game, um, what's actually in the Jerry's mod and different things like that. So anyway, if you guys are looking for just to, uh, how to download and install it, um, I've showed you guys how to download it and the links are in the description so you guys can do that. So so first thing you guys can do is go to um, open your Minecraft, go to options, force update your game, click done and log in. Once you guys have done that and you guys are logging into your Minecraft game, um, the reason why we're doing this is because if you guys are updating Minecraft, it gets you a clean Minecraft folder. Um, if you guys already had mods installed, uh, maybe this maybe this Jerry's mod is not compatible with your mods that you have installed. So if you have mods installed and you didn't force update it and you get a black screen, that's probably why, because you did not force update your game. So I do recommend backing up your files and saving them. So anyway, if you uh, have force updated your game, and make sure you close Minecraft out when it's done force updating. All right, so if you guys see on this bottom left-hand corner, you see percent after that percent so if you just click start you click and you type in percent a p p d a t a that's percent app data and another percent so then you see the roaming folder on the very top so you click on the roaming folder you move this aside you see this minecraft folder on the very top here so if you open minecraft and you open bin and you see this minecraft right here if you try to open this folder you won't be able to so if you right click on this open this with winrar um if you guys do not already have WinRAR installed, there will be a link in the description so you guys can download that and install it. So once you guys have opened your Minecraft.jar with WinRAR, you guys can see this folder right here. It's called MetaInf. So if you right click on MetaInf, delete these files, push yes. Um, this, this deletes MetaInf because um, if you do not delete that, your Minecraft will get a black screen and you will not be able to run Minecraft. So once you have opened Minecraft.jar with WinRAR and deleted MetaInf, open Minecraft Forge. Um, if you just move this aside, you'll see MetaInf there also, but you don't delete that. So if you just select all these files and drag them straight into Minecraft.jar that you open within R, push OK, you're done with Forge. Um, again, Optifine, I did uh, download that. Um, the link will be in the description. It is not required for this mod, so you do not have to. Um, so if you just select all these files, drag them in, push OK. Um, note, um, if you are going to download Optifine, make sure you guys get the 1.4.7 version. Alright, so once that's done, you guys can exit out of the Minecraft.jar that you open with Linar. And um, if you're still here, click back one. You need to be where it says bin, resources, and saves. Um, if you guys have already exited out of that, um, the re how we got to that was with percent app data percent. And then we went to roaming, and then we went to Minecraft, and that's where you see bin, resources, and saves. If you click on new folder, or you just add a new folder and call it MOD. Yes, all under caps, push enter. Open this mods folder and move this aside. If you guys open the Jerry's mod folder that you guys downloaded, open this one and drag this Jerry's mod.jar straight into here, and you guys are done. You guys are done installing it, and you guys are ready to play. So you open Minecraft and you log in. Um, your Forge mod loader is going to set up right here, real quickly. And uh, as soon as that does that, um, if you guys are getting a black screen here, it's because you probably had mods installed and you didn't force update your game, or you didn't install it correctly. So if you go to mods right here, scroll down, you're going to see Jerry's mod is right there. So it means that uh, Jerry's mod is installed and it is working. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, again, if you guys uh, are just here for the, um, you actually want to see what's in the mod, you click on this link right up here. It'll take you to um, my... Uh, my video of, of demonstrating what's in this mod and also there will be a link in the description for Captain Sparkle's video um, again thank you guys so much for watching if this video helped you please give it a like and subscribe for more mods